to tonight on Owl House. Uh, <laughs> See, I trapped you. Welcome back to Dead Space, everybody. You're in the Crumple Zone with Cody. <gasps> You're in the Crumple <gasps> Zone with Cody. Yeah, we're gonna talk about Owl House. You know who my favorite, uh, who my favorite character in Owl House is? Ida. Dipper Pines. That's fine, too. <laughs> <laughs> this is also the correct answer. Mm. So, so for real. Last time, last time on Dead Space, we uh, were a, a massive cock tease about Owl House, but no longer. Yeah. Oh, it's such a yeah, so, genuinely good show. Yeah, Cody told me about Owl House a couple weeks ago, yeah. and it it launched on Disney Plus a couple days before this recording. It's November first, and I just binged it all in like a day and a half. It's the fourth of November. What are you talking about? Yeah, it showed up on November 1st on uh, oh, Disney+. Plus. I thought you meant we were... I was like, no, dude, what are you talking about? Today's the most anxiety-inducing day of the year. And it's going to be the most anxiety-inducing week, just because of the fact that it's, like, mail-in ballots and stuff. Yeah, that's what I was alluding to. So anyway, Owl House. Uh, I'm not letting you escape this time. No, you are going to let me escape. We're going to talk about this terrible thing that's going on in the U.S. <laughs> right now. Or potentially good thing, depending on... Depending on uh, how it's politics, there's no winning. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Like, that's uh, a really dire uh, way to put it, but. So, Owl House. <laughs> okay, give a synopsis of the show. Oh, hang on. Kendra's right. <laughs> We're gonna take is completely shot. I'll need your help to fix this. Kendra, if you can hear me, see if you can get to the ship's reports. Yeah. It sounds like you have better access from there. Yeah, yeah. When were you going to tell us about the artifact, Hammond? This. Marker. I don't know anything about that. It's referenced in the captain's records. They brought it up from the planet. It's on the ship? In cargo. They think it's of alien origin, but I don't know what the hell it is. Really? Have none of you he watched he Ridley Scott? Anything about it. You're lying. Back off! I am not the bad guy. Here. Uh. We're all shaky right now. You're gonna have to trust that I don't know anything about it. <laughs> We've entered the debris field. Get to the captain's nest. I'll explain everything later. Hammond Bye, out. Hammond. You you look a lot different from the one you're from your new role in Overwatch. So anyway, uh, all personnel must pass so the security anyway. bioscan before entering. So yeah, what is the basic synopsis? No spoilers of Owl House. A young a young girl who is um considered a weirdo by her peers and her superiors basically um is about to go to a con like a, for lack of a better term conversion camp yes. to make her less weird yes. and instead she ends up in a magical world where she is taught the ways of magic by discord from my little this pony is correct i literally described this to you as girl goes to Harry Potter, her headmaster is Discord. Now that you've finished the first season, am I correct? Yes. <laughs> oh, I remember this part. It, it Actually, you know what? I'm gonna amend that. Okay. And I know that you haven't watched the... Ah, I know thought. that you haven't watched... Nice. Perfect. Uh-oh. You about to start losing oxygen? Stabilized. We've got to get the ADS working. You were saying? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna amend that to uh she's actually taught by a combination of Discord and Mr. Miyagi. Yeah. Okay. Cause it's because it, the way that it works is that it's very vague and fluid the way that uh our main character is taught magic. Yes. Are you teaching me or being a weirdo? Yes. Yeah. Beca because of the way that, like, the magic works in this universe is that as an outsider to the world, she doesn't have the necessary, like, connection to, to magic that other people have, so she has to, like, improvise. <sighs> Level 3 suit? Yes. I'm gonna open this door, but I'm nice. not going through unless it forces me. Is there a store in here? Hammond no. is in here. I'll get- I'll be back for you later. Continue. I want that suit. No, it's a good. Sh it's a good show. It's one of my favorites. Yes. 
Ida is the is the weird Mr. Miyagi Discord character. And she is literally a weird outcast who sells odd baubles of human in like I, origin, and it is fantastic. Yeah. The animation's good, my, the characters are solid. Thing. Hell yeah, the dude. World my favorite is interesting. thing about yeah, okay. Sorry. My favorite thing about that whole thing is um that it's the common trope of um non humans find human things interesting, but not the interesting things that we hu we find interesting. Yes. You know what I mean? Oh yeah. It's twenty thousand, I just spent that. Okay, hang on. Oh no. I I actually really did have twenty thousand and I just spent it. I don't need the line gun. <laughs> just get rid of it. I'm actually gonna sell the uh, uh the torch. I genuinely don't want it. You may as well get rid of your flame fuel then too. That would probably be uh, a good idea, yeah. Only eight thousand more to go. I can make it happen. Wait a minute. Do you have anything in your safe that you can sell? I. That's what I was exactly gonna look. I know. Damn it. Fully empty. That's. Oh. Okay. I guess it'll wait. You know, you would have had enough money if you just played through. I bet you you're right. This is a piece of $20,000. Also, this sucks. That food coma is super hard. Ooh. Why do you always eat right before we record and get sleepy? Because I'm hungry. I'm hungry all the time. I am just turning off that audio log because guess what he's saying? We're all gonna die. Yeah, that and cut them up. Every single one. Cut them up. I don't know how you could have gotten this far, but don't forget to cut them up. I understand that it's like even in the bridge, people were freaking out, but it's still very funny to me. Yeah. Like, of course, all of the all of the memos are going to say, hey, you should probably slice these things open from like from the outside in. But the fact that we are we are now as outsiders getting these audio logs as we've gone through. Um. About a quarter of this entire, like, uh, Planet Breaker? Planet Cracker? Planet Cracker, yes. Yeah. It's... Like, yes, I get it. And I uh, just, Isaac, just... I just imagine Isaac rolling his eyes in the fucking... In the helmet. Just like, yes, I know. God. Worse than my parents. Be careful. I saw something out there. I don't know what. I only got a glimpse. It was big. Really big. I really... Who's your favorite scene from Owl House? Too late. We're talking about this now. It's a spoiler. Oh, no. It is the episode... I think it's called The Invader or The Intruder. Okay. It's the inciting incident of that episode. Oh, okay. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Yeah, I think so. Shit. Oh, hey. Oh, that one was dead when I sealed the pod. These things don't die. My favorite episode is the monster problem. Oh, yeah. The, um, the, uh, <laughs> with the really cool, how do we defeat the monster with, with friendship and love. Interpretive dance. Yes. That's not Magic a joke. Magic interpretive dance. Dude, that sequence was so good. I watched it like 15 times. It's so good. I, I, I didn't finish the episode for like an hour because <laughs> I was watching that scene over and over again. It's so adorable. It I is, love it. It's precious. It is delectable. Hi. Tang. Yeah, kind of. Oh. Hey, it's a boss fight. I told you I remembered this part. Big arena, items everywhere. I'd like to. Whoa. Yeah, it's a damn shame you got rid of your flamethrower, buddy. Oh my god, holy shit! Wait, I'm alive. I thought I died.
This is really tough. I'd imagine. Oh, wait, hold on. That'll probably help. Uh oh. Oh my god. Oh, you're gonna hit it with stasis? Oh my god. <laughs> I need to go find a healing item. Oh Jesus. Stay over there. Hello? <laughs> it's gonna come kill me now. Ah, uh, you're okay. I believe in you. Oh man. You're gonna die. Oh god. Hammond, please help me. <laughs> This sucks. Ah. It'd be so easy for him. To, oh, okay. It'd be so <laughs> easy for him to just get up and like fucking just come out. I bet you the flamethrower is a totally good strategy for this boss, but I'm fucking super not able to do it with that now. Because you're just super thirsty for that level three armor. It would have been super helpful against this boss, wouldn't have. Oh. Wouldn't it have. Wouldn't have. have. God, those weird contractions are the best because, like, English is a fluid language, but just thinking about the fact that uh, Yolative is Yolative. a word that you can hear but not spell without having an aneurysm. Every time someone talks about the word Finna, I get really angry. <laughs> like, I mean, like, it really annoys me. I hate that because it's it's the most not a word word that exists. Oh, come on, don't be like that, man. It's a good word. You sound like my, uh, you sound like my math teacher when people would say 50 instead of 50. Like, she would, a she would actually, like, stop people mid, uh, mid-explanation of a, like, a math, math solution and be like, I'm sorry, 50? 50 is not a number. And I'm like, yes, I get it, but come, come on, can we just... I'm sorry, come we can on, no longer on. be friends. You're implying that you're someone who says the word fitty. I do not say fitty. <laughs> oh, dude, are you kidding me? I oh my barely, god. Like, in my day-to-day -day, day -day life, I can barely get, count past, like, six. <laughs> I don't need to. <laughs> no, it's how much money is in my bank account. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Fucking did it. Hold on, let me just. Yeah. I keep missing. I keep missing. I can't. <laughs> That's fine. Anyway. Oh my god. Never take Isaac to the batting cage. <laughs> yeah, right? Make us whole again. Wow, it started that I'll early. I'll make you whole again. Damn, girl. What? Oh, the audio clip. What? No. That's... That box is lies. Asshole that bullshit lies. Because it looks like it's an item box and it's just a fucking suitcase. <laughs> hmm. Oh, you have so many notes. Yeah, I found a bunch. I also bought a bunch, which is why I couldn't get the armor for the, before the fight. Oh well. Yeah. So we're talking about Owl House. Now that that now that that boss fight's over, yes. Yeah. Right. It always likes. Uh, it's always what? interesting to me that like Disney always does these things where it's like. Hey, go to school, it'll make you smarter. Even though part of the base premise of the Owl House is uh, school makes you kind of dumb because it's all about conformity and like being the same. Yes. Because every lesson has been, it's okay to be different. Mm hmm. Every lesson. That and every forgiveness is all right. Yeah. To give and to receive. I should yeah, buy the flamethrower. Speaking of which, Cody, I forgive you. <laughs> it's true, I did that thing. 
<laughs> that thing that's mostly unforgivable. I put a Cruciardus curse on you. Oh god, is that why I wake up sore every morning? <laughs> Isaac, your new suit's the coolest. Dude, I, I want to start the like I want to start a Twitter game now, like that's that's similar to that. Like you know you know the uh, you know those Twitter games of just like say of texting like it's like hey hey girls here's a fun game text your boyfriend I'm positive and see how he reacts. Oh. Don't. Hey, hey, text text your best friend and say I forgive you. <laughs> See what happens. The thing is, is that if you do that, a very small percentage of guys will go, Oh, you found out? <laughs> yeah, exactly. And you're like, huh, huh, No, what? And then, yeah, that, that, and then that reminds me of a post that I saw just this morning where it was like, Hey, don't take this the wrong way, but I cheated on you. Response, uh, me too. Response, April 1st. Response, June 27th. Oh. Here's a fun game for you kids today. Send a random text message to the to the person you haven't talked to in like five years and just send them I forgive you. That'll be fun. So a couple of times they've mentioned things. Hello? A couple of times they've mentioned a thing called a marker. Have you been paying any attention to that? Yes, it's a thing that came from the planet and is possibly alien in origin. It is possibly alien in origin and might be related to some stuff happening. But that's just conjecture. No, it was an accident. I had to stop conjecture. Arrest the doctor. Okay. Also, I fixed that thing, by the way, if people didn't notice, where before the camera I'd have to turn it really like awkwardly like that. I fixed it. I turned on nice. the infinite edge. Save the game. Fucking, what, you shadow the hedgehog now? Oh, yeah. The hedgehog. Edgy the hedgy. Edgy the hedgy. That's the name. Don't wear it out. Contact beam schematic. Edgy the hedgy. Remember the name, motherfuckers! There's something about <clears throat> shouting remember the name that's just the best. You mind. That's my favorite four minor song. Mine too. It's the only one I know. Bum, 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 it might not be the only one I know, but it's the only one I care to remember. I'll put it that way. It's the only one whose song title you remember. Yes, which is funny considering. It looks like some of the gravity plating is yeah. functioning. I think like obscure Four Minor song that my uh, that is my favorite is uh, "Get Me Gone." Oh no! About, not what? this room. What is this room? Where are you? Well, the scary trumpets have started coming up. Um. They said there have been artificial gravity malfunctions in this room recently. Yeah, like that one. Nice. It's gotta be sure. Please stop doing that. Come get me, weird baby. Motherfucker. What? Oh. Reload. Come on. God, you're an asshole. Let's go. What? Why aren't those hitting? There we go. That was really weird. Anyway. The weird anti-gravity field is fucking with them. That'd be cool if the projectiles are flying up into the ceiling because the gravity's so high. That's how you wanted curved bullets. Yeah, kinda. There's something behind you! Alright. I, I don't know what all the drama's about. Oh no, it's the maze. Get out your bone saw. Hmm. You know what? You might be onto something. 
Bone saw. He's ready. <laughs> Holy shit, that was effective. See, this is my favorite weapon in the game. The Ripper. Yeah. Damn it. No! Oh god. That's <laughs> so mean. Anyway. Yeah, the Ripper's rad, and it's my favorite. In terms of weapons that are just iconic and interesting, it's up there. Come on, it makes Beyblades deadly. It does. As opposed to what? Flywheels. Actually, you know what? I take that back. Flywheels are a lot more dangerous. <laughs> Do you remember those? I don't know what you're talking about. Oh no, no, flywheels are like, it, it's like Beyblades, but it's like, it's tire, it's rubberized tires on the edge instead. Holy Jesus, just, really? Yeah. No, not that. Oh, this. this. There's two of them. No, there isn't, shut up. A little anticlimactic on that. A little bit. Uh oh. Uh oh. You missed. Uh oh. Reload. Come on. Oh my god. Getting a little tight in here. Out of stasis and health. Alright. There it goes. Power node. It's not what you need right now. Oh boy, is it not what I need right now. I would have super died if I hadn't got the third uh, to your suit, by the way. That's what I was seeing that was like, oh no, it's the second one. I saw it too, but it didn't move, so I was like, maybe it's not that bad. Oh. That's not as much health as I wanted. Damn it. Alright. It's, it's as much health as you needed. It's exactly as much as I need, which is not enough. Is The answer is to always say that you don't have enough. Where it is the... There we go. And that's why they put that there. That's how you know that shit's involved in a puzzle, when they literally put the thing on the environment. Yeah. Stab it. Power transfer to the ADS. Ship systems junction box rerouted. I'm making some progress with the tracking grid. One of the cannons is giving me a hard time. Ooh. Keep moving. Hammond, you better have some kind of real good reward at the end of this, because this is bullshit. Spoilers, there's nothing good at the end of this. There's never anything good at the end the of this. The best thing to come out of Dead Space 1 is Dead Space 2. <laughs> <laughs> no! Oh my god, I almost killed myself. <laughs> that was so close. <laughs> I forgot that some of the panels that weren't activated are activated now because you rerouted to power. I almost blew myself up. Nice. Ooh. Hey, once you save, uh, go back. I want to see what happens when you touch oh, those. Oh, it's super fun. Uh-oh. I know you're there. I smell nightmares. Oh, okay. <laughs> that super didn't work out the way they wanted. Because he was in this... You, if you look really close, you catch him going into the ceiling, and you're like, oh, shit. But I right. was already doing a floor stomp, and he landed in the hitbox of my foot when he landed, so I instantly did damage. And then you just cut him open with your line uh, line gun. Just gotta mulch him with the line rack. Yep. I think that's gonna do it for this episode Hang of Dead on. Space, guys. One, we got yes. No, as in you, I want to get. You want to do the gravity thing? Yes. Mister, I know everything about my brother's magazines. Uh. 
My brother doesn't write magazines. You have a brother? He has magazines. Yeah, it's you. Yay! <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> so brutal. All right, we'll see people in the next one. Yeah, I think this is the episode of Enjoy, oh. guys. Bye. See you next time.